Morning folks, Dave Smith, Correctional Officer Lifestyle. Uh, just got done in the gym again. I know I only posted a video two days ago, but I'm going to go on ahead and try to wrap up the series, uh, the Core Value series. Um, we've already talked about truthfulness, integrity, responsibility, and cooperation. Well, today, I want to talk about the fifth of my core values, accountability. Uh, in your life, you're going to be held accountable for a great many things. Um, you can be held accountable at your job for your job performance. You can be held accountable at your house for your performance at the house. You can be held accountable for your finances. Um, miss a truck payment, and I promise you, the finance company will hold you accountable for the payment that you missed. Okay? Um, but in the, in, the, in the greater scheme of things, those are things. What else are you accountable for? You're accountable for the welfare of your children. You're accountable for the welfare of your spouse. If you are a supervisor at work, then you are accountable for the people that you supervise. You got to take care of the people that you supervise. Um, and, and you know, if you're one of those that the accountability that you have for the people that you supervise are as a stepping stool to get you to the heights that you want to get to, just remember that those folks that you stepped on to get up there might be climbing the very same ladder you're falling off of when you get to the top. So you, you, you really want to you really want to take care of the people that that you have in your life. You know, you want to take care of those people. You want to take accountability for them. Um, something that I say in the Department of Corrections often enough, okay, what are you, what are you accountable for in your work location? You're accountable for your keys. You're accountable for your equipment. You're accountable for all your paperwork. You're accountable for the inmates that you supervise. You're also accountable for the staff that you supervise. Um, <clears throat> accountability does not only go for material things. Your accountability needs to extend to friends, to people, to people that work for you, to your pets, to your wife, to your spouse, to whatever you've got in your life that you truly love, you need to take accountability for it. Okay? Um, that being said, folks, it's just... It goes right along with personal responsibility. You've got to take personal responsibility for the choices you make. Well, you might as well go on ahead and make choice to be accountable for that choice. It kind of makes sense to me. If it doesn't make sense, I'm sure somebody will leave a comment below. That's all I got for this video. Uh, accountability is really an easy one, you know. Hold yourself accountable because other people are going to be holding you accountable. I'll see you in the next video. David Smith, Correctional Officer Lifestyle.